Hello everybody, Wild Bill for America here. You know, it's no longer a matter of if we get hit, it's now when we get hit. And what are we gonna do about it? When American men, women, and children are lying in pools of blood just like Paris, France, what are we going to do about it? We know that the military will clobber some terrorists overseas. Local police officers will probably kill some of the Islamic attackers and go on a manhunt to find the rest. But what are we the people going to do about the traitors in our own government who are working to bring these terrorist attacks down on our heads? Barack Obama is working feverishly to bring hundreds of thousands of unvetted Syrian men right into American neighborhoods. Terrorists among us, sponsored, fed, clothed, and probably armed by our own government. When our blood is shed by these Muslim monsters, what will we do to the American government officials who literally set up the slaughter? The government officials whose duty it is to protect American lives, not set us up as blood sacrifices to Islam. Never has the USA seen such a gaggle of traitors in the federal government. The most vicious killers in the world are coming to America, compliments of Barack Obama. The military can deal with the trigger men. Police can arrest those who attack. But what about the Americans among us who sabotage our national security to allow the killers in? What is our plan to deal with the liberal left-wing media who looks the other way? With liberal politicians who refuse to take reasonable steps to prevent bloodshed? What about politicians like Hillary Clinton who has Muslim Brotherhood operatives on her staff? Well, I don't know about the rest of you, but I don't like being set up. And the system that's supposed to keep elected officials honest has failed because elected officials have simply stopped obeying the law. What are we going to do about it? This is Wild Bill for America saying, think about it and be prepared because it's coming. The Obama-sponsored jihad is going to hit the USA, and we need to have a plan. Thanks for watching, and America, bless God, again.